We are offering a community of global citizens who are creating value for every individual in this world. We are doing that by preparing graduates who are comfortable with being uncomfortable and can adapt to a rapidly changing and ever complex world. We're also bringing in uh, collaborators and people from across campus and across disciplines and across industries that allow us and remind us of uh, all of the different uh, facets that go into today's engineering problems and help us to hone our skills in terms of working on teams with this multidisciplinary and interdisciplinary nature. Engineers solve problems and Marquette engineers are doing that in the context of safety, um, reliability, impact on customers and not just um, for the dollar sign. At Marquette University we talk about how engineers need to make decisions in companies. So when they are faced with an unethical situation, they have been given the tools here, tools that they can use to make sure that they make the ethical decision. So we are expanding our capacity in areas of global concern in water, health, energy, manufacturing. The research at the Water Quality Center has been used to increase renewable energy production at municipal wastewater treatment plants through a process called anaerobic digestion, which makes more biomethane and more renewable energy uh, for those facilities. Also, we have licensing agreements on different technologies to increase industrial waste treatment technologies to protect the environment. We're working on new energy uh, saving technologies for biotechnologies to treat industrial and municipal wastewater. We're working on looking at micropollutants such as prescription drugs, fate, and removal in our environment through the work of Dr. Patrick McNamara. We're looking at nutrient recovery from municipal wastewaters and industrial wastewaters for reuse through the work of Dr. Brooke Mayer. Uh, in the past, we've been involved with a 10-year collaboration between the Biomedical Engineering Department and Milwaukee Institute of Art and Design, where we've had um, several MIAD students, industrial design students, each year work with six biomedical engineering projects. And this year, we've added some mechanical engineering projects. My colleague at MIAD and I thought that if we could bring these two groups together to work on projects, that they would, uh, we would end up with much higher quality prototypes and we've been doing this for 10 years and now we're, we're seeing prototypes at the end of the course that are functional, they're nice looking, they're aesthetically pleasing, they're safe and you can look at them and figure out how you turn them on and how, how to use them. ELEAD is an undergraduate engineering leadership program and it is a people focused technical leadership. Through your program we focus on leading oneself, leading with others and leading technology and innovation. We currently have 40 students in the program. We consulted with a number of industrial advisor boards and before we even created this program. And we are excited about the transformation that we are seeing in students in a very short time. Here in the Marquette Visualization Lab, uh, we're using what's called immersive visualization. That means that what we're looking at will uh, cover our full peripheral vision out to about 180 or, or 200 degrees, so you're really surrounded by whatever you're looking at. It allows us to bring out things that would otherwise perhaps be masked by a complex uh, data set. By parsing out these things using uh, 3D stereoscopic uh, techniques or uh, color metric renderings, uh, we can better present this information. These techniques can be applied across different disciplines uh, and provide value to different uh, applications across disciplines. We've been a member of the Keen Network, and their goal is to um, help colleges create an entrepreneurial mindset within their students. This network consists of about 20 schools that are trying to accomplish the same goal as we are, and this is about creating a mindset, um, having students focus more on the customer's needs and creating value for the customer, the company, any of the stakeholders. And uh, we are providing resources for our faculty to implement changes to their courses so that their students can help develop this entrepreneurial mindset. When our students are out in the field and they talk to the other students, engineers who are hired at the same company, they start to realize that Marquette is different. Marquette has a very large industry connection pool as well as just job and recruiting program. And the support that they get here teaches them how to be on their own. They are taught the skills that they need 
to network and to build what they need in their careers. I know they're going to go on to be amazing people who are going to not only reflect on Marquette well, but more importantly, they are going to have tremendous impact on their communities, whether it's their you know, technical communities, whether it's their uh, church communities, their school communities. As a Jesuit institution, we are called to be men and women for others and to do so as servant leaders. And that gives us the ability to really make good difference, important difference in the world which we serve.